cut that string what a size down see through it covers it you can't adjust the back since it's not skinny jean but sometimes for fashion you need to sacrifice your stomach Hello, welcome back. Today you're watching Jessa Chen. In today's video, I'm excited to do because my favorite YouTuber, Nikki Damar, just launched a clothing line with Shein. I never ordered anything from Shein, so this gives me the opportunity to try out Shein clothes and give my honest review on it. This video is not sponsored. I bought everything with my own money. So let's just get on to the video then. The first outfit I did get was this lace-up shorts paired with this two top. I didn't get the whole outfits for everyone because there's certain pieces I wanted to get because I wanted to make sure it was actually items I actually would wear or didn't have already in my collection. It's definitely thicker material. It wasn't the material I was expecting. I was expecting more like like a softer material maybe, but it's still it's thick enough material. So I feel like it's going to be more supportive. So hopefully it fits. Now the top, it's not bad material because I did feel the other ones so far. Some of them felt really cheap. So this is not as bad. struggle putting on honestly the zipper it was stuck like the there's like a string or thread that was stuck in the zipper once i figured that out i cut that string and then it let me zipper it so i could put it on besides that everything else went on good also what i noticed is you i don't know if you can wear underwear with these shorts because um it shows your underwear i'm like that'd be weird to wear no underwear though <laughs> i don't know if there's like a pair of underwear that you can go wow show i don't know there's no thong enough to go up here so you either wear this with no nope, underwear or with underwear that kind of like goes like this lace black pair i did tie this tighter at first but i did like it where it was loose that's the style we're going for so maybe if you tie it tighter, you won't see the underwear. I like the look where it does that. The shorts do fit. I did leave the tag inside because I wasn't sure if I'm going to return it or not. But they do fit, so I don't think I need to return them. And the material, like I said, wasn't the material I was expecting, but it doesn't... It, I feel like it's thick enough material to wear out, you know? It's not like thin material. The top... I, I put a strapless bra on, but you could probably wear like a bralette if you want, whatever's comfortable for you. So far so good, but she was going for like, like punk rock vibe. Like that's like kind of her whole collection. Overall, I give this outfit, honestly, a nine out of 10. I know, like I'm surprised it's like good quality. The only problem was I didn't give it 10 because I couldn't put it on. But other than that, it fits good, so that's why I give it that such a good rating. So I think this was not a miss, it was a hit. So the next piece, I didn't really, I didn't buy the matching top with it. So I'm probably just pair with this top since I already had this top on. But these are called, I think it was, let me see. Let me get the right terms. <laughs> Pretty sure it was the biker short. When I, okay, I wasn't even gonna get this. Last second I got this biker short because I was gonna get another dress. Cause I only have one dress they buy, I realize. I was gonna get a dress, but I wasn't iffy. I'm like, I probably won't wear it. I don't need it. But then when I was scrolling, I saw this, this. <laughs> that looks good on Nikki, of course. I had to get more biker shorts. So of course I'm like, oh my God. It's only six dollars, so of course I'm gonna get it. But when I'm looking at it now, when I opened it, I didn't try it on yet. We'll see. It looks kind of big, but you know we don't know until I try it on. Can't say anything. Try to try it on. Yet. So I read a review because they didn't have reviews when I bought it, but now they have reviews. The thing it runs big. I'm like, oh. hopefully it fits me. <laughs> I guess I'll show the struggle a little bit. Okay. So I had to change the underwear because it obviously you can see it. I did a thinner one that is a big on my waist. Should have gotten an extra small. I was afraid that it'll run small because I don't normally get extra small things. Besides that is thin material. So you can see it's like see-through when you pick when I pick it up. But like I love the idea. Honestly, it was cheap, so I'm not gonna talk about the material that bad. The only thing is I would have sized down. Or I can what I I don't know if you noticed what I did. I like overlapped it on my waist, and I can wear like a t-shirt over it or something. So you can't really tell because with this shirt, this two top, you can see it. So I grabbed a cropped 
shirt. I know you still can see it, but you, but I, because I try to wear it for a regular t-shirt, it just doesn't look like I'm wearing that much under because it has cutouts. So you gotta show out the, show the cutouts. Because I forget, like it's if it's high waisted and you have a smaller waist, you might have to size down. I didn't think about it because it is stretchy material. So if I got it after small, I should to stretch. <laughs> I forgot to rate the shorts. Can't really judge it good enough. Okay, let's just say if it was in my size, it would definitely be like an eight, like an eight. Because they're a little short. I'm used to longer, but I mean, if I lower it down, it'd be a little bit shorter. But it is a little big on me. Yeah, since they're big on me, they're like a, a six. But if they fit me, probably an eight. We move on to this cutout. Is it cut out? I think it has cutouts. This dress. So I'm gonna put this one on. So when I open it up from the package, it definitely feels like this lightweight material. So this dress feels like that top that two top I was wearing. Actually, I think this one's the dress is thinner. It's gonna be interesting. Let's kind of see through. Okay, so this dress. Definitely that, I, like I said, the thin material, but definitely actually might be the same <laughs> material from the biker shorts I was wearing. Because it reminds you of the cutout right there. I just don't own any of these kind of dresses like this, any kind of dress like this. So that's why I got this one. It looks cool on her. She paired it with her fishnets, so I did too. I'm wearing black. Well, not the underwear is not black, but the black strapless bra. I wonder if I wore like a colored bra, if it would be see-through. So if I wore the seamless underwear, that's what I would wear this out because you can see that, the outline of it. You can see my belly piercing, but I don't like taking it out. So that's okay. Uh, would I size down? No, because you want your, you want, I want it to be comfortable. So I think it was good on the size as well. So my rating for this, this is a 7 out of 10. I'm not like crazy about it, but it's not, I don't see that much wrong with it besides, you know, it's the material, but you get what you paid for. Okay, right, move on to the next piece. I got halter cover up. I thought it was for swimwear cover up. All right, so I gotta say that the at least the black bang suit i have fits with it so the crochet material which is actually a trend right now and i've been wanting to get some kind of cover up I'll, i'm gonna get or probably go for another video like the skirts as well but yeah, i want some for summer or spring for the bikinis so i'm excited she had one so of course i got it and it fits me because you can adjust the top to tighter you just have to tie it yeah, it fits me. It's a small, and then she, in her actual um, photo, she was wearing some kind of boots. I wouldn't wear that to the beach or something, a pool. So I just put sandals on. I know festival season, I guess, apparently is up. I don't know where I can go to a festival anywhere near here. I gotta look it up. So I wanna maybe do that so we can get some photos. All right, so my rating for this one, definitely. 10 out of 10. I don't see anything wrong with it. The material is good. It definitely would make you feel more confident because it doesn't show like exactly everything. It's like it covers it. You feel more secure, comfortable, confident, and pretty in it. Cute. Definitely 10 out of 10. Okay, enough of this one. <laughs> Moving on to just the tops I got because I didn't get the bottom. Like, oh, oh my god. The matching bottom with it. This top, she wears uh, like a, a flared out skirt. I didn't feel like I would wear it besides maybe, or <laughs> my music videos, yeah. I do music videos. No, my fashion videos. So that's why I didn't get the skirt, but I never, I don't have any top like that. And it actually comes with sleeves. So you can wear these sleeves with any top flare at the bottom. So I definitely excited to try this one out. It isn't adjustable, the, this part. So that's gonna be interesting. So hopefully it fits. Ironically, I found this skirt in my collection that's actually from Shein, but I know I didn't buy it. I think my mom got it. She probably thrifted it. So I never actually ordered anything online from them. So I think I thought this would look cute with it. We'll see. Cause I feel like it's similar to one of her looks she was actually she has her collection oh would they they she calls it the marble print so i feel like it's marble print okay, like i said i was nervous about the straps it does fall off sometimes like this and i i, I was like wasn't sure what kind of bra to wear with this because 
it shows your bra. So I wear a black bra so it like blends in. Cause I don't wanna wear strap, you know, not strap. Oh, I said strap, strap. I don't wanna wear braless because it is kind of thin material. So for this, probably best a black bra. So it goes like a black strap bra. It does not fit me well unless I lower it down. <laughs> and then when you lower it down, it shows your bra. So it defeats the purpose of this. <laughs> I mean, with the bra, it looks okay, but it does take off points for that. And then these um these are cool. I never own anything like it. So you can probably pair with any kind of black tops, or you don't even have to wear this. Bra. But it makes it look more edgy, more. I don't know if Y2K. I don't know if they wear the flares like this. And then I did pair it with this skirt that is she from Shein, but not from her collection. I'll actually see if they still sell this down below, but if not, then you can just get like a similar marble skirt. So yeah, it's like mesh, which is like a trend as always, this mesh <laughs> material. So the rating. Here we go. This one's gonna be a lot that good because it's like not that functional up here, but if you wear the, the black bra, I'll be fine. So. And then you can probably wear this other things. Keep that in mind. I'll give it a six. I still can wear it. It's just some things could have been improved. I don't know if it's a little big on me. That's why. If so, then six is still good. Look, this cutout shows my bra. What do you want me to do? Wear no bra? No, 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 no. You gotta make the, the material thicker. Excuse me. Who do you think I am? Next top, or we could say corset. Or is it a corset? Because it is a thin material. It's not that thick, so maybe that's why. Because I do have another one that I think was like a more like a lingerie corset type. This is more like a top. Oh, I so said they're all tops. It is that lavender purple color. She, it's good for spring this color, but she was playing with more colors because um, Nikki doesn't normally really wear like these colors. She's been wearing more pinks and purples and these brighter colors so that's cool because i love i do like color as well besides i do like black so she's playing with both black and purple but i didn't buy the skirt because i don't i already have a black skirt similar to that so i need to add another one to my collection so i do have a skirt that has like a little chain on it right there i don't know let me see if it has a brand it says miss fashion luxury it was thrifted so i don't remember um i don't know that brand Okay, so for this outfit, I last second decided to put these on because I saw like in the photos, the other model that poses for her and her stuff, she had this on. I'm like, oh, I have this. So it just it added a, a more of an edgier look, more clothing. So it's like less bare arms. I feel like that's good to do because Phil had, you have to be more confident wear this out. But if it looks like you're wearing like sleeves, it maybe makes you feel more confident. So definitely another edgy look. I did put my hair in ponytails because she did in her photo as well. Okay, so let's talk about the look. So the, I'm not sure if you should wear a bra with this or not, but it doesn't fit me quite perfectly. I don't know, because you can't adjust the back. Only these straps. So it's not really, is isn't helpful if you don't have like a bigger chest. So it might be better for like a bigger chest or if I wore like a bra, I'd probably feel more comfortable. So I'll have to find a smaller bra or like bra, those sticky bra cups, I don't own yet. I should invest in it one day when I see it. Oh, well. So yeah, the top's kind of awkward because if you do it tight, it does sometimes raise over my chest. So I don't know if I need a bra then to keep it stable or I need a smaller size. I might need an extra small then for a tighter fit. Like besides the fit, I do love like the, the, the style, the look, the design. It is thin material, but that's what the washi and stuff is. 7 out of 10 because it's not fitting properly, but I still love the design. So the next one is not even called a corset either. So I guess that's just how they call it. They call it lace cami top. We got this one. It's a different, I've never seen it before. It's like a, it comes down like this. So it's gonna be interesting. See if it looks flat on me. I hope it's not the same prom where it's, see it doesn't even adjust at all either, this one. So it might be too small on me. But anyways, I paired it with these, they're called skinny pants, but I, I think they're like the leather pants. I, I've been wanting to get leather pants. Looking at it right now, it looked like it might fit, but I don't know, my, it is high-waisted though. She wears a belt on her 
photo. So that might not mean, that means she might not fit her. Uh oh, I'm scared. It's not gonna fit. Sorry, I can't with this fabric. These pants weren't what I was expecting. They fit, but there was there's a lot of extra fabric in the crotch area. So if I size down, it would be too small. Cause I don't think they let you size down with crotch by the whole thing. Everything else is tight except for the crotch. So that's okay. Okay, so I realized that I had it on backwards, but it's still like big in the front and like in the crotch, like the fabric is bunched up, and then the back is just there's just it's just kind of big. It's just big on the waist. It doesn't feel flattering. It doesn't look flattering. For these kind of pants, I would want it uh, to be tight feeling. Besides that, the corset, perfect size, love it. <laughs> Happy with this, but then they got this. No, so this one was a little bit of fail. She wears a belt, so I'm gonna probably try it on with a belt. So I probably wouldn't pair it with this top again, but with the belt, it does bring the fabric up. The top, 10 out of 10, fits perfect, surprisingly, but it has no adjustable straps, so I don't know it will fit everybody perfectly, but for me, it fit me perfectly. And then this, I'm gonna give it a five out of 10, because I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to wear it. Only maybe with a belt like this. Then again, you don't want to have clothes where it's gonna be like annoying to wear. So I might have to return it. Okay, so the next one, I'm a little bit nervous if it's, if it's even gonna work because it's just, it looks like it'd be loose. So I did get the matching outfit um, she has in the photo. The white top and the like it's like a pink purple flared jeans. That's like perfect for spring. I don't ever owned a flared one before or high waisted either actually. So this is being new to me. This top of course feels like that cheap swimsuit material. <laughs> Let's talk about this one. This one was a wild one, crazy one. First off, the top, you gotta wear a bra if there's no way, no way Jose I'm wearing it braless. So I put this black bra on, it kind of looks like a top underneath. So it kind of makes it just a look with that. That's what sucks about that one. So I might return the top unless I would wear the top like this. It's only presentable like this for me. Are these kind of pants, they're too big right here. Um, a lot of time, cause I have a small waist. I have this problem where it's big right here. So I could wear like a belt with it or just wear it like this. There's no big problem for that, but because the, the big problem is, I don't know if they make petites for it, but it's it's really, it's like, since it's not skinny jean, it's flared. Yeah, I have to wear some higher heels with it because it's too long for me. I am short and I wonder what kind of heels Nikki is wearing. I think she was wearing like white heels. She's short too. So it's gonna get dirty at the bottom, but they're really cute besides that. So if I got it too small, it might be too tight right here. The only thing is if they made like a shorter hem, I definitely would've been perfect. Besides, obviously this, I have this problem a lot. It's only certain sizes you can pick from, so I can't really, I can't do it too small, it'll be too small. So I can, I get that part. So this one is good overall. I did pair this butterfly as pink in it, so it matches the jeans as well. Let me rate the top. This might be the lowest rating. I just thought it was a natural top. It's maybe it's because it's low, it's too big on me. I had to wear a bra and I couldn't figure it out. Pants, they're really cute. Uh, definitely give them an eight since they're too long on me and this thing. But besides that, everything's good, so it's not really uh, negative. For my body type in particular, it's gonna be big on me right here and too long, or yeah, too long because I'm short. All right, so we made it to the last one. I mean, I did, but <laughs> I mean, if you're here, you did. She keeps wearing braless stuff. She's not wearing a bra with this one, is she? Actually, this material is like the thickest one out of all of them, it feels like. So I, it won't be see-through. I need to get one of those bra, you know, those sticky bra cups. And then the jeans was the only one I got an extra small because baggy jeans, I don't, I'm afraid it's gonna be run big. So we'll see if it's too tight on the butt for me. Cause that's when I had my problem with, if I want to get a tighter waist, the butt's too small for me, for my body type. I wasn't sure if I got the right size. It is tight. I did get an extra small on these. It does fit the waist. That's why I thought I need to get a smaller size. But when I sit down it is quite, tight 
Do you think they'll stretch out over time? I was afraid because they're baggy. What? I'm afraid that they're gonna be too baggy because I'm not used to wearing baggy jeans. So the length um is a little long on me. If you wear tall enough shoes, this one's not that tall, but it's not like it. It's um it's hitting the ground. Whatever. Whatever. It just I'm short. It happens. <laughs> Enough with the jeans. Now, it is cute. The thing is, you can't really wear a bra unless you want to show it. It's thick enough not to wear a bra. Or wear, you can maybe wear like bra, like a, you know, the sticky bra. And then it comes with this, the sleeve. It ha has it where a hole at the end for your thumbs. So, I didn't notice that until <laughs> I put it on. So, that's cool as well. Definitely feels like 2000 with these sleeves. So I feel like I own a pair at that time too, but those are gone when I was younger. So the rating. This one's cute because I saved it for last because I was excited for this. One. I'm not sure if I would wear it out or at least, I don't know, maybe for a photo. I don't know. It is revealing because you got to wear no bra. So the top, we're going to have to give it probably eight. Because depending on if this is like your style, it is good quality the top. It's just, it's a little bit out of my comfort zone. So then, the jeans. Now, they are tight sitting down. But sometimes, for fashion, you need to sacrifice your stomach. If you're not sitting down a lot, these jeans are for you. Unless you want to size up. I didn't want to size up because it'd be too big. I'm going to give them a 7. Nothing crazy, they're just jeans. Should I give them an 8? Because if it's your style, I think it's cool. Actually, an 8. Because nothing's wrong with them. It's just, for my body type, it's going to be either sacrificing sitting down or have a bigger waist. <laughs> but you have to wear a belt. Okay, guys. So that was the last outfit I bought from Nikki's collab with Shein. I believe that it's definitely her style and definitely influenced by the 2000s, Y2K, punk rock vibes, and some things for spring for sure. That being said, because it's Shein, it is going to be low quality pieces. You get what you paid for. Just like how I've been hearing from people and reading reviews and stuff. Just keep that in mind when you buy these pieces. But I hope this helped you figure out what pieces you do want to get from the collection. Or like the sizes. If it's worth it or not. Because there's definitely some pieces worth it. But some weren't. As you can see. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like the video if you liked it. And let me know what your favorite outfit was. And remember to subscribe. So you can watch my future content. And help me grow as a YouTuber. I should mention I, I made it to over 1,000 subscribers now. Thank you guys so much. It wouldn't be for you guys. So have a good day. Bye.